crypto market melt up. This is a update right now because we got Bitcoin back above 61,000. It's at 61,714 right now. It is Friday, May 3rd, 1218 p.m. Today, we saw the dollar meltdown. If we look at the daily chart, big red drip right there, just drip down. And then if you guys remember, we had that 12 hour sell now back here. It was like April 21st. We finally seen it come to fruition. Uh, the last 12 hour sell now that came in was back here. October of 2023, what happened after the dollar ultimately saw it roll over from that sell now, October of 2023, we saw Bitcoin hit new all time highs months after that. So we're seeing a repeat of October again. And from my opinion, May is about to be amazing. So if we look at the bond yields too, we saw a meltdown, a red drip. Same with the dollar, red drip. And then for the US NASDAQ 100, we got a green bean stock, a one day buy now signal. The last one day buy now signal that flashed was back here in October of 2023 as well too. Um, so we're seeing the drivers, the macro drivers lining up. If we look at the crypto drivers, this is the pump dump chart. We are right now at the micro 786. If we break down through this, then we can target the 2618. And if we do that, we'll see that TSI come down and melt down through that zero line here. And then the last time that we did that was back here, February 15th of this year. And we had that cross down as well too. And what happened on February 15th, that was back here. Bitcoin finally started to got it. Uh, got its legs after the January correction back here. So in my opinion, not financial advice, not a financial advisor. Um, just as I stated in the Discord, in the announcements channel, that on April 30th, that this quick pull down would see 57K flat and would need to bounce quick right from it. Um, this was right here. When Bitcoin was like at 61K, I said back down to 57K, quick little up move and then hold support at 60K and then we can shoot up. It looks like we're doing that as we speak right now. So I thought it was going to be May 1st, but hey, a couple days later, um, definitely still in the realms of on track as far as the, the videos that I did back, um, I think it was like the last week of April. Yeah, so crypto price analysis today, part two, cracking the, the code to price. So yeah, it was April 24th. So we're on track. So if you haven't seen these two videos yet, we're definitely on track with what the expectation was which may is about to be amazing and if you made it here throughout all that ruckus in april then congratulations because to me it looks like up only uh it does look like you know bitcoin if it can break above 62.5k then we can come and retest 70k again and we'll have to see how we go at that point but basically if we look at the pump dump chart we have that getting ready to melt down, which means crypto is already to melt up. We have the alt season pulse chart right on these lows. If we can break down to the top of the belly of the beast and then get eaten by the belly of the beast, then we're going to go into the 2024 alt season because when we broke into the belly of the beast back here in 2021 for the alt season pulse chart, that was the big alt season of 2021. So that's what I'm tracking. I'd watch those two videos in the Discord. Link is in the bio and market updates. We're still on track with all that. I'm just giving an update today to let you guys know that everything's all good. It's exactly what we're expecting. This crypto bull market is not done yet. We're getting ready for the grand finale here. So I'm still on vacation till next week. Uh, I think it's May 8th. So I'll see you guys full-fledged with videos May 8th, but until then, in the Discord, I'll keep people updated with screenshots and anything if anything um, kind of wild happens. So I'll see you over there.